I'm Mr. Derby for life. I'm here burning my pile full of junk and whatever else I have laying around. But I am going to do a new, new video, new car video, or should I say truck video? Yes, I have a truck on my property. Actually, two trucks. But they are not derby trucks. They are going to be something else that has not been on this channel before. Um, and I do not own these trucks, but I am going to help him build these trucks to become mud trucks. So my buddy had this great idea of buying this truck here to become a rat rod. Then he realized that it was too much work to make it into a rat rod. So he bought a different one and turned that into a rat rod, which was basically already built. And then, and then decided that he wanted to or drive it around and whatever. So he had this one just sitting around at his parents' place. And then he asked if he could store it here. And I said, sure. And on the way over, he decided what am I going to do with this thing? And he decided that he wanted to turn it into a mud truck or a drift car or something. He was still kind of 50-50, and then he found this truck, and that's where he decided to turn it into a mud truck. So this body here, it's a 54 or 56 International, I believe he said it was. And he bought this truck, which is a 83 Chevy, whatever, junk body. But the frame's pretty decent. For, we actually just got this thing running, driving today. Transmission's good, so that's all we need. The guy that he's, that sold him the truck decided to, or decided that he, or he wanted the motor back, so we have to pull the motor and give it back, so whatever. But we got it running, driving, to find out if the four wheel drive works and if everything works and it does so that's perfect so we're going to be pulling the body off um the box is already off if you can tell but we're going to be pulling all that off and we're going to be sticking this 56 international onto this frame and we're going to turn this thing into a mud truck which i'm going to help i'm not going to own any of this truck um i don't know if what he is going to decide if he wants to store it here he wants, oh, oh, looks like it might decide to rain or something here soon. So I might, should hurry up on this video. But anyways, we are going to throw this body onto this frame and stuff. And we're going to build it in my shop here. Uh, we're actually, his other truck that he has, he's going to pull that apart as well. And he's going to be painting that. And we're going to also be doing that in this shop as well. So I will be getting videos on that as well. So stay tuned for that kind of stuff, guys. But this is going to be a very, very fun build. Building a, an actual mud truck. Well, a different kind of mud truck. We're going to... A 56 International mud truck on a newer frame. Which the frame is actually fairly decent. Um, the, there is still factory paint. Um, this actually was a plow truck here in Minnesota. Which, I'm surprised this thing isn't rusted out and gone, completely gone. But it's actually decent yet. Um, yes, it is flaky. So, uh, we were talking about maybe sandblasting it and then priming it and painting it. Just to, so it would last longer for us. For him, I should say. Because he's going to be the one <laughs> breaking this truck. But I'll, uh, since he's been helping me with my cars and stuff, I'm going to help him with this stuff as well. So it's a fair trade, and he's put a lot of effort. I let him actually run my blue car that I have in there, which you guys just saw in a previous video. If you have not seen that video, go definitely go check it out. It would be under the aftermath of Hutchinson 2019. But, yeah, this thing is going to be a lot of fun to build. Um, I don't know too much about it right now. Um, we actually just... Threw a boat tank on there, strapped it down. We actually ripped it around here a little bit, and it's got, it's the motor runs like crap. So, but we're got to pull that anyway. But we're gonna be putting. He's gonna be buying a very, very good 
350 motor and we're going to be he, we're going to be ripping stuff out in the in the mud pits so it's going to be a lot of fun but yeah there you go guys there is a new project that's going to be starting here in the the DD Derby shop I think that's what we're going to call this place the the DD Derby shop the double D Derby shop that sounds better. The Double D Derby Shop. That's what we're going to call this place. But there you go, guys. So thank you guys uh, for joining me in this new adventure that we're going to be doing here with over the winter. Right now it's September, so in the next couple months we'll for sure be working on it. <coughs> oh, excuse me. But we will be pulling the body off and stuff uh, probably here in a few weeks or something or pulling the motor at least I don't know when exactly we're gonna actually get going on this project but stay tuned this will be in the works but thank you guys for watching my videos I appreciate it don't forget to hit the like button subscribe button and we'll catch you guys in the next video